Singapore's Changi Airport has expanded its link to all South Asian cities to the pre-pandemic level and added Maharashtra's Pune to its network. The airport has been re-established in view of a strong rebound in passenger traffic, according to a media report quoted by PTI on Sunday. The number of passengers and flight movements steadily climbed over the months. Currently, up to 150,000 passengers are passing through Changi Airport daily, and about a million every week, the Straits Times newspaper quoted Transport Minister S. Iswaran. In the first 10 months when the airport managed 23.6 million passengers, Australia, India, Indonesia, Malaysia, and Thailand were the top traffic markets. The strongest passenger traffic recovery came from North America, South Asia, and Europe, PTI reported. Citing the reopenings of Terminal 4 and the southern wing of Terminal 2 which took place in September and October respectively, the minister said that the airport is well equipped to handle the higher volume. As per PTI reports, the daily traffic is more than twice the number that passed through the airport when Singapore first reopened its borders to vaccinated travelers in April. Meanwhile, Vistara, India's full-service carrier has started direct flights between Pune and Singapore. According to the Gurugram headquartered company, the airline will operate 4x weekly flights on this route. We are excited to be able to connect Pune and Singapore, two cities that were not directly connected thus far. There is a growing demand for air travel between the two cities, especially from corporate travelers, Vistara CEO Vinod Kannan said. Vistara increased the frequencies of flights operating to Frankfurt and Paris from Delhi following the induction of the third Boeing 787-9 aircraft in its fleet. The airline said it would operate six flights per week between Delhi and Frankfurt while the frequencies on the Delhi-Paris route would increase to five times per week.